Hey everybody, it's Kendra. Welcome to my channel if you're new and welcome back if you've been here before. It's Tuesday, time for Tuesday, yay or nay. So my product today is a drugstore mascara because I am always on the hunt for a good drugstore mascara because I like to find something that is affordable and easy to buy, easy to get. I don't like having to order mascaras from all over the world. I will do it if there's something really amazing, but I prefer to have something that I can find locally. So my product today is by Maybelline. It is their The Falsies Volume Express. So this one, very easy to find. I probably got mine at Target or Walmart, don't even remember and it's very affordable, it's around five or six dollars. So that's great, I don't like to spend loads on mascara um, because mascara is something you wanna dump every few months. Like they say, I believe three months, you wanna be chucking your mascara um, just cause it can harbor bacteria. So you don't want anything nasty near your eyes. Anyway, let's discuss this baby. So first of all, when I think of mascara, what makes a good mascara? It needs to have a decent brush and it needs to have a good formula. So when these two things come together and they're both done really well, and they come together, they can really, really excel. Now, the brush on this one, I feel like this brush is so awkward. So first of all, it's like this weird sort of spoon shape. Um, you can see it's a little bit curved here, and then it's definitely like flat. Um, it also is one of these kind of flexi brushes. You see there, it has that little joint there and it is flexi. Um, I didn't really find that this made much of a difference when I was actually applying my mascara. My mascara. I didn't feel like it was flexible enough to really budge with my eyelashes. Um, I don't really like brushes like this. I don't really see the point. If I want my mascara wand at a different angle, I actually prefer to just bend the wand itself because um, I find that just gives a better angle um, than this like flexy sort of thing. Also the formula. I found this formula to be a little bit too wet and just like if I had to describe the formula in one word, it would be like goopy goopy or clumpy or gloppy or something like that. Um, I feel like this is a very difficult mascara to apply if you want pretty sort of lashes. If you want like to have five clumpy lashes where everything is stuck together, this is totally the mascara for you. Um, I didn't find that it gave me volume. I didn't find that it gave me length. I just found that it made my lashes really just clumpy and it was very, very difficult to use. I don't like that clumpy sort of look. So for me, it was like really, I was really, really, really trying to just use it um, to like my liking and to get everything sort of separated. It was very, very difficult. Also, I just found like when I was using this, it's very difficult to apply without making a mess. I feel like the brush, the brush is kind of big. So I did feel like it was very easy to, um, to just kind of get it, you know, underneath your eyelids. And if you're doing your lower lashes, it's very, very easy to smudge on your actual skin. And also finally, I always curl my lashes before I apply mascara. My lashes basically grow straight down. Um, so I really need to curl my lashes to just make my eyes look so much more open. But I found when I use this mascara, it really like weighed down my lashes. It almost felt like it made them wet. Like if my, once my lashes get wet, they're going back to their normal state. Um, so I found like this, it sort of removed that nice pretty curl. I felt like it just, my lashes weren't necessarily straight down like they normally are, um, but I felt like they just kind of, they still were up a little bit, but it wasn't a nice curl. It was just very like harsh and it's not, just not overly pretty. So I am giving the Maybelline Falsies Volume Express Mascara and nay, I did not like this. I found it to just be a really clumpy sort of mess. You know, if that's what you like, you might like this. I thought the brush was weird. I thought the formula was weird. And just together, it just, it was not working. I was not feeling this at all. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in my next video.